Cleveland's only all-weather show. In-depth, live, and focused on you. This is the 19 First Alert Focus. Hi everyone, meteorologist Kelly Dobek here. I want to talk about the Waffle House Index when it comes to severe storms and especially hurricanes and especially Hurricane Milton. So what is the Waffle House Index? Why are we talking about a restaurant and what does it have to do with severe weather? So it's an unofficial way that people and actually emergency management teams, FEMA even, uses to determine how bad a storm threat is going to be. So it's an actual index. Waffle House even pushes it out on their social media pages. It has been actively used by FEMA for years for different hurricanes and different situations. So what is it? It's actually a level of three different colors indicating how severe storms are going to be and if Waffle House is going to be open. Waffle House does everything in their power to stay open for folks when there's severe weather, when there's power outages. So, you know, it gives them a little glimpse of hope somewhere to go uh, to warm up or cool off or even, you know, have a hot meal for the first time or have electricity. So let's talk about the index. There's three different colors here. If the Waffle Waffle House index is green. It means the restaurant is fully open, full menu. They've got electricity. You really don't have to worry too much about storm threat being immediate in that area. If it's yellow, it means, yeah, there's most likely storm damage around. There's a limited menu, possible power outages. They might be on a generator as well, but the Waffle Houses do have generators, so they try to stay open. Now, when we see a red Waffle House index, that means damage and destruction from severe weather is happening or has happened, and it is closed. It is significant damage. Damage. And the reason I'm pushing that so hard is because Tampa, Cape Coral, and St. Petersburg have already closed Waffle House locations before the storm even officially makes landfall, which is a good indication that we are going to see a lot of storm damage along the west coast of Florida. Waffle House tweeting this out. You see all the red markers here, mainly along the immediate west coast. There are some green further inland towards central Florida, but this is uh, just another indication that Hurricane Milton it could potentially bring historic damage. Now your 19th first